Good morning guys, we are just now pulling up to Corsa Motorsport located in Huntington Beach, Southern California. For those who don't remember, Corsa Motorsport took in my Lamborghini Aventador about two weeks ago to get our car wrapped. In the meantime, they let us borrow their 600 LT, their 720S, and this AMG GTS, which has been so much fun. We're a couple minutes away from Corsa Motorsport, so we're gonna return this, and we're gonna see the Aventador. And if you guys caught our video two days ago, there's a little issue, so we're gonna deal with that when we get there. This AMG has been so much fun. Sounds so good, I've really enjoyed it. But hey, all good things must come to an end, and it's time we turn in the keys to the AMG. Always the coolest cars out front of Corsa. So many cool things. Bag, twin turbo, Uricon, 570, 600, and an M2. Like, I love that color though. It looks really good. Like, I guess up close, like, I see it. It's like really gnarly. Damn. Dude, the color's so sick though. With the yellow, like, calipers. All right, wrap reveal in three, two, one. Alright, so the color we chose with was a Nardo Gray. This specific color is from Avery. It's a gloss dark gray, but we have an issue. And as I kind of showed in the last video, and when you see it in person, you can really kind of see it. But as I come in closer, you see all these like, it almost looks like it has a texture. That's called orange peel. Now this wrap color in this Avery really, really exemplifies it. But also there's these like almost like cat scratches all over the vinyl, which you can kind of pick it up on camera. It's on honestly kind of difficult and if we pulled it into the sunlight you'd really see it a lot more but ultimately the wrap is defective and it's all over the roll you can see a lot of it right here like right in here those little scratches are everywhere and the orange peel on this color is just ridiculous and as you do a gloss color you really fight that a lot more but with the matte finishes it hides it more but this is not an installer defect this is a manufacturer in the wrap defect so unfortunately guys this is just not the quality we can take home and Corsa called me and they're like we're not gonna let you take this home they want me to choose a different Nardo gray to rewrap there's a few other ones out there that are a higher quality vinyl that we can use that are a little bit different in shape but I don't care we're gonna have to do that or ultimately you guys can decide do we keep the Nardo gray or do we change it I originally went with the Nardo gray because gray is actually brain cancer awareness color and I thought it was really cool because I've always wanted a Nardo gray car like the BRZ but I wanted it on the Aventador and because it was brain cancer awareness that color has kind of resonated with me obviously because of Sabrina so I went with their Nardo gray I'm gonna put a poll in this video right up here do we keep the Nardo Gray or do we choose a different color? So go ahead, boat, pick either Nardo Gray or pick a different color. We will go off of what you guys say. But I'm bummed, the thing looks killer. It looks phenomenal, but this is not gonna work for us boys. We're gonna have to rewrap it so we can either keep this color or change it completely. I'm interrupting today's video to give a product spotlight on Meguiar's Hybrid Ceramic Wax. It is no secret that this is my favorite Meguiar's product that they offer because it keeps your car the cleanest for longest. What I mean by that is, is it uses the hybrid ceramic technology to kind of help create a water beating effect. Here's a clip from last week when I was showing the effects on one of my cars that had the hybrid ceramic wax on there. See the water just fall off like that? I put the Meguiar's hybrid ceramic coat on this car months ago, like literally months ago. And look how the water is just beating and falling off. Like look at it even on the top of the hood, you see how it's all just like beating and just look at that. Oh, that's amazing. Not only does water beat off it, but this helps keep off contaminants and it helps dust not settle on the paint and rather just fly off. All you have to do is wash your car and before you dry it off just spray down a layer over the whole entire car rinse it off and that's all you got to do this stuff will last you about a month or so so the next time you see it in the store be sure to pick out the hybrid ceramic wax it's definitely my top pick from mcguire's lineup thanks so much for mcguire's for supporting the channel and now let's get back to today's video
There's a few colors in here I am looking at, and one that I've been considering, I just don't know how accurate it will be, is there is this kind of dark forest green color that is kind of similar to the 458. Hard to see in camera, it's a little more green in person. Doing a gloss dark green would be bold, but there's really not a wrap color that I think really captures the British racing green. But this one kind of is close. So I'm thinking about doing that, but there are so many colors to choose from, and I feel like I'm kind of starting over on square zero if we don't do the Nardo gray. You guys gotta leave some feedback down below because I do not know what to do. All right, so it is settled. We are not taking the Lambo back today. I'm bummed, but I can't be mad at them. It's not their fault. Uh, I just called my Uber. Uh, it should be here any minute, I think. Oh, what do you know? The Uber's here. Oh, sick. Uber's really uh, upgrading their rides as of lately. Thank you, Corsa Motorsport. They are letting me take the 600 LT. This is a new one they just got in. If you guys don't know, Corsa Motorsport offers rentals as well. So if you guys are in the Huntington Beach area and want to rent any exotics, you can come here and pick pretty much about anything else out. And what's dope is all their cars are modified. So you get modified cars to rent, which is pretty awesome. So I really was not a fan of the 720, but immediately I hop back in the 600 and I love it. I don't know what it is about the 720 that I didn't like, but I really enjoy the 600 so much more. And although I do miss the Aventador and I want it back more than anything, I think I'll be okay for the next few days. Just got some gas. I got some water, some almonds for the drive home. Brought my sanitization spray. Spray my mitts a little bit. I'm gonna drive with the top down on the way home. That might be a bold move, I realize that. As I've always said, you don't have a convertible or a spider and then not use it when it's sunny out. It's currently 95 degrees, but I have a hat on, so I don't think I'll get sunburned, and I have some AC, so hopefully it kind of keeps me a little bit protected from the sun. We have an hour and 24 minute drive home. Let's send it. The more I drive this car, the more I am 100% decided that the 600 LT is by far the best McLaren out there. An overall car, the 600, to me, is the best one there is. It's a lot less numb than the 720 is, and it's still blistering fast, and it still has that characteristic of a go-kart that you want. And look at this, San Diego views. If you look out, you can actually see a battleship out in the ocean. I'm not sure if you'll be able to see it on this camera, but that is so cool. That's pretty cool! Big wing gain alert and wide body spotting. Damn, that is one big wing, brother. It was funny, as I was driving into my neighborhood, I pulled up to another 600 LT, which these are like pretty rare, so it was very low odds that we were gonna find another 600 LT. And we pulled up to him, and I pulled up to him, and he was like, oh, dude, that's cool to see another one. And on the underside of his wing and on his mirror caps, he had like, almost looked like paint splatter on the mirror caps and on the wing. And I was like, oh, that's dope. Where'd you get that done? Did you, did you do that or whatever? And he goes, no, it's from the factory. And I was like, <laughs> I'm an idiot, sorry, I'm not a McLaren guy. I don't know McLaren things. Apparently, that was a McLaren thing. I don't know, it was really cool. It was black and it had like these stripes on the middle and had stuff on the mirrors and the, it was really nice. If the poll says to not do Nardo Gray, I know what color I'm gonna do. I'm gonna tell Sprinter what the color is and I'm gonna film her reaction and you guys will take of it as you will. What does that mean? The color I'm gonna do. Oh, great. Let me really, let me really get myself prepped and ready. I'm gonna do like, a bright. It's like deep. What is bright? What does bright mean? Is that like sparkly? Here's the color on my phone. Uh, I mean, it's pretty basic. Wow, not a strong <laughs> response at all. <laughs> basic? That's basic to you? <laughs> they ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're but fine. That's okay, you're I really think it's gonna look really great. Get into but it. I mean, kinda. What? You know. I'm saying that, I have to believe that every time you say that word. What? Wow, I'm disappointed. Wait, are you really? Yeah. Well, boys, it's the end of an era. Can't see me crying under this. <laughs> like, you have a Porsche Macan. The Hi. fact that you're upset because we're trading this in, I don't understand. Because I love my Mazda. Sure, I mean, but I, like... I'm sure I'll love the Porsche more when I can drive it. But this is my... This is what I was driving before. Now I'm not driving at all. <laughs>
Oh boys, this is it. She had the CX-9. She had it for nine months. No, nine sorry. Nine months, I had it for two months. She had it for two months. Uh, it's times like these that sometimes I wish we David Dobrik style vlog where we just had a camera rolling on us at all times. We were literally just leaving our neighborhood and some kids were like, that's a nice Lamborghini. We pulled away and TJ was like, it's McLaren, you <laughs> it's McLaren. It ain't a Lamborghini. <laughs> we're gonna go get some. Oh, I can't eat queso. I'm a cheat, okay? I'm a cheat. We're gonna go to a Mexican place down the street from our house and meet my parents for some dinner and some margaritas. And I'm not supposed to have alcohol or cheese, but I may indulge myself tonight. <laughs> so this one isn't as loud as the last one. Yes, it is. No, it's not. This is not as. This is not as loud. TJ. It's still like sure it might they have a little bit. All, it might have a little bit of volume. It literally shakes the house when you're coming down the road. <laughs> this right here is a good sight. These look so cool. I'm telling you guys, one day. Don't you need this is a good sight. <laughs> wow. Sabrina had lots of drink at the hey at dinner, which I didn't. <laughs> I didn't film, but she, uh, yeah, she had a good time. I love this car so much, guys. I, I want one. I really want this car. I think I'm gonna get one eventually. One day, I'm gonna get one. The 600 LT Spider. Only thing about McLaren is they depreciate so much in value. You should get a Lamborghini Urus instead. Lamborghini Urus instead. That's what you'd rather have. I don't know when, but one day I'm gonna have a 600 LT and I'm gonna enjoy the living piss out of it because I love that the car. The living piss? Yeah, the living piss. I'm gonna enjoy the living piss out of it. I can't do it. What are you doing? <laughs> Three more. I wasn't even looking at you, so whatever you did, it was a wasted effort. Ladies and gentlemen, yeah, it was a wasted effort. Ladies and gentlemen, have edited to today's video. I am so tired. I kind of slipped up on vlogging at dinner. I apologize, boys. It's because we were having too many margaritas. <laughs> Pillow don't, fight. Don't. Oh my God, you need. To, <laughs> yeah, you need to go to bed. She needs to go to bed. That being said, oh. I knew. I knew. You nearly. <laughs> you. S Wake up! Did you not just realize that your foot <laughs> skimmed my face? You nearly just punted me in with no, your foot. Will you survive? Oh I don't think so. Peace out and no. keep. You <laughs> <laughs> cough on me. You guys. Okay. Peace all right, out. All right. Peace. Let's do it together. Come on. At the same time. Come on. At the same time. At the same time. Okay, guys, he's out. We're doing it ourselves. Peace out and keep. Wait. Okay. Yeah, okay. Bah. Moving. There's not going to be a blooper. Forward. There's not going to be a blooper at the end of this video. I'm sorry. <gasps> this Disappointment. Is, this Boo. is it. This, wow. I'll be the blooper. Peace out and keep moving forward. Especially in times like today. Keep moving forward. How many times are you going to do that? Three. <laughs>